hey there, I am Bound to Tell, and I'm directing this video towards a friend of mine, Latham Way, and anyone else who happens to be interested in the subject of anarchism. I would like to briefly introduce you to what I think of when I use anarchism, uh, which tends to be in line with anarcho-communist philosophies, uh, and I will discuss the specifics of a lot of this in a series of videos I plan on doing, where I will elaborate on this introduction in great detail. Ideas for how society should run are necessarily complex, and as such, nothing I say here should be taken as being concrete or 100% what I believe. I am offering this as an introduction for so that it may act as ammunition for some questions that might be asked. And I, offer, and I uh, invite you to ask questions about other philosophies within anarchism because I have done significant amounts of research into it, and so I at least will know where to look to immediately get an answer if I do not already have it on hand. And I will be able to offer sources, if necessary, uh, to, to prove that, that that is indeed what one philosophy says. Um, so as such, I would like to offer this quick introduction to my own, and we can proceed from there in a series of discussions. I'm an anarchist in the sense that my ideal world is one without a state. To sum up the basics in an absurdly long sentence, I believe that the trend of decentralization of power will continue until the state evaporates and technology will eventually allow for societies to exist without an autonomous governing body looming over them, and will eventually be able to provide all of the necessities of life. Necessities of life so that none are left without the means to continue living regardless of their contributions to these societies, because I believe it's unethical to condemn someone to starvation, thirst, homelessness, poverty, and death for laziness or a lack of success, though being successful would directly improve one's quality of life from that basic level by utilizing the representations of their contributions by way of money to purchase excess and luxury goods in whatever way they see fit as long as there is no infringement upon anyone else's abilities to do the same, and that these products are not sold for profit. Now, I know that many of you watching this video have many things wrong with what I believe there. Instead of flaming me, or just calling me a dirty commie, and I'm not saying that Laidon Way, my friend, or any of you shall, but I do know that there are people out there that will react to this viscerally. I invite you to ask me honest questions about what I believe so that you can learn from our differences, rather than immediately associate me with the likes of Lenin, of whom I dis with whom I disagree profoundly on many, many issues. I am by no means a subscriber to the Bol Bolshevik ideology, and I have nothing to do with that aspect of communism. I, if it wasn't obvious, I'm a non-statist communist. Um, and the complexities of that and the details of that will be explained in future videos. If there's any particular aspect of this that you would wish to know more about before flaming me, feel free to ask me a question or two, and I will address them at some point, either as a direct response in that comment, or I will make an entire video about it, depending on the severity of the importance of this particular uh, item. I look forward to having the opportunity to elaborate on many of these points and to answer many of all of your questions, uh, so that I might be able to share more about what anarchism actually is, because it goes so woefully misunderstood by most. Uh, just, just to offer a parallel, just like many Christians will mischaracterize the ideas of atheists and what atheism actually is, many statists will mischaracterize the actual ideas that anarchists believe in. It's 3.41 and I haven't eaten lunch yet. Um, so I'm quite hungry, and I'm very distracted by that fact. Um, but for some reason, I decided to make a video instead of go eat, for some reason. So clearly, you should be an anarchist, because we prioritize you over ourselves. You can go eat some fucking food.